hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel i am back i am back i am back again with another video okay guys so uh, in today's video i am going to be telling you how i got a copyright strike oh my god copyright strike am i supposed to be crying <laughs> am i supposed to be i'm here laughing i'm supposed to be crying right okay but at the end of the day i still smile okay at the end of the day i still smile now uh i'm going to be telling you how i got a copyright strike on one of my videos all right so um copyright first of all let me tell you copyright strikes are different from copyright claims okay with copyright claims you can actually it doesn't harm your channel it's just a warning but if you keep if you keep on doing that if, you, if they keep giving, giving you copyright claims you might end up in copyright strike but copyright claims are not harmful they are not harmful they are not harmful to your channel okay because when they give your copyright claim what they what you need to do is just either you delete the they just follow their rules either you delete the video or you trim out the copyright parts the copyright part okay if it's, it's, it's if it's music if it's music that the copyright claim is you can actually trim it or you mute it okay i've never mute new uh, i've never done the the muting stuff but i've heard people say i can actually mute uh, a, a, a music okay so but what i've done actually is that i've trimmed i've trimmed out a cop a, 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 i've trimmed out part of my video that was stems copyright okay so there's one that was music was because of music i had to trim it out there was one that was because of a picture imagine a picture a picture I, I i removed it i trimmed it out and there was one that was because of a short very short video that i trimmed it out now that copyright claim it wasn't harmful to my channel okay it wasn't harmful but what is harmful copyright strike oh my god guys you can actually do a research on copyright strike to understand exactly what i'm saying copyright strike is very very dangerous now if you have three strikes three strikes guys you are off youtube you're off youtube like there is no you coming back to you or oh, the like you're off they're, they're closing your account that they're deleting your account you will never ever 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 make videos on youtube again you never ever have a youtube account maybe unless you have to use another person's name face or whatsoever identity and so on but you being on YouTube, if you have three strikes on YouTube, that's the end of it. Never till this world comes to an end, you will never ever have an account again. Your account will be deleted forever if you have three strikes. All right. So you have to be very, very careful. So copyright strike is very, very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. Now, what happened? What happened? Oh, that I got a copyright strike. Now, for some time i've uh, i've been within a month now or let's say within two weeks now i have been very very busy very very busy i could not do videos that i'm in i could not do my own videos yeah i couldn't do my own videos so what i did was i wanted my channel to be very very active so i i i uploaded um people's content guys oh my god <laughs> I'm not going to call the names, but if you have been watching my videos, you will notice that there are some things that uh, are different. That you will notice some change, some dif some different videos in my channel. All right, that were not actually made by me. All right, so I uploaded like two videos, no complaint. I, I felt like okay, I can actually take people's video and modify it, add my own things there, and then upload it. I didn't know it was very very dangerous now i went and touched the most dangerous video ever <laughs> i went and touched the most dangerous video ever i uploaded i added my own stuff there i added my own stuff there and merge everything together uploaded it one day two day third day my god on when when on youtube youtube sent me a message that they have deleted that video okay i was like fine Oh my god, if they have deleted this video that is harmful to my channel, fine. Huh. So that was not all. That was not all. If we had deleted a video, that was not all. Now they went ahead to give me a copyright strike. Copyright strike, which means I'm, I was having one strike, remaining two if I have additional two. And they told me that within uh, uh, 90 days, if I have another strike, I will not be able to upload videos. 
for two weeks and then if i get another strike again that will be the end of my youtube journey oh my god after all my suffering hmm. god cannot shame us oh god cannot allow god cannot allow god cannot allow after all the sleepless nights oh my god okay so that is how it happened so i uploaded this video and now the person having that video or controlling that channel or whatsoever is the one that sent youtube a, not a, 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 a message or notification to give me a strike yes because these people they have options they can either ask you to you that to share the revenue you make on that video with them or they can either warn you and ask you to delete those videos or now they can either give you ask you to give you a strike so they have their options they are the ones to choose now these people ask you to they choose the part of the strike they ask you to to give me a strike that is it so oh uh, i can't blame them i can't blame them like it's their decision okay it's their decision and it, it was my wrong okay i did not really know i thought i can actually get videos get videos of people at my own stop there and then i upload them i that's actually what i thought but at least i've learned a lesson and i'm so happy that god has been on my side and oh uh, everything is good everything is good if i'm smiling it means everything is if i'm smiling like this it means everything is blessed if you want to know if the strike is still there because normally strikes expires after 90 no, did i say normally expire after 90 days oh my god forgive me guys I attended what they call copyright school. They said if that the strike can expire after 90 days if I attend the copyright school. Now I attended the copyright school and it was successful. Now I have to wait for the 90 days. So they said my they gave me a strike 9th of January and then said it will expire 9th of January February. Oh it will expire um ninth that's in three months time 90 days i think so okay so they gave me that strike and and asked me to attend a copyright school if i want the strike to expire after 90 days now i attended the school and it was successful it was successful guys now uh but i have to i'm i'm supposed to be waiting for the 90 days to see what is happening or to see what will happen to the strike okay i'm supposed to wait for the 90 days to see what will happen to the strike now guys if you want to know i don't want to say say what happened at the end of the day here now you can contact me on my facebook page ako ketchen ako ketchen <laughs> oh my god you can contact me there or if you want um i'm going to write my facebook name at the comment section so if you want to know what happened to the strike because i don't want to say it here i have my reasons i don't want to say what happened uh here i have my reasons so if you want to know more or oh, what happened to the strike or uh, uh, whether it's still there whether it's still is not still there i will put my facebook name at the comment section so you can get me there you can you can actually get me through that yes we can talk there okay all right so that is it i attended the copyright school and supposed to be waiting for the 90 days for it to expire so guys it is very very dangerous for you to upload people's content if you love your channel i will advise you please please don't do what other people are doing don't think that people have reasons why they do it some people are uploading other people's content and they are not giving them a strike or they are not it's not harmful to their channel they know what they are doing some of them are working with these so-called people and they are sharing the revenue together so you don't just get yourself into trouble by getting people's content and uploading them like what i did and i was in trouble okay so it is very very dangerous for you to be uploading people's content very very dangerous then say i do not want you create your own content create the smallest chance ever to create your own content if you are as busy as what it's better you should be uploading one time or two times in a month than to be uploading people's content because if they close your youtube account you will never ever have an account you will never never have an account on youtube again so you have to be very very careful the way you go about uploading people's content all right so that is just it that's how i got a strike got a strike by uploading people's content so youtube sent me a, not a notification that i've deleted the video and have given me one strike giving me a warning that if i have another strike if i have three strikes 
they will have to delete my account and i'll I never have an account on facebook again on youtube again oh my god <laughs> on youtube again so you have to be very very careful so that's just it i said let me share this experience with you all right so thank you so so much guys for watching please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're watching for the very first time and leave a comment at the comment section thank you so so much for watching and please please do have a blessed day